Feather color for guinea fowl is governed by incomplete dominance. Fowl may have black, white, or blue, which are heterozygous feathers. Let's start there with our legend. If it's incomplete dominance, then we write the legend C, B, C, B is black. C, W, C, W is white. And C, B, C, W is blue. We know that the blue is the heterozygous, so that has to be our 2PQ. Now, since black and white, neither of them is dominant, they are incompletely dominant to each other, it doesn't matter which one we make our Q squared and which one we make our P squared. In randomly mating population of 500 fowl, there were 88 black. So since they give us the number for black, and we always like to start with Q squared, let's make that our Q squared value, which means the white has to be our P squared value. Now we're trying to find how many are heterozygous. So we are looking to find 2PQ. Let's start with our Q squared value. It is 88 out of 500 which is 0 0.1176. Then we can find Q, which is the square root of Q squared. And that is 0 0.4195. P is 1 minus Q, so 1 minus 0 0.4195, which is 0 0.5805. And then 2PQ is 2 times 0 0.5805 times 0 0.4195 for a total of 0 0.4870. Now check back, they asked how many are heterozygous. And we want to know that as a whole number. So for how many we multiply our frequency by the total number in the population, which is 500, to get 243.5. But we want it as a whole number, so we are going to round that to 244 guinea fowl are heterozygous. And we're done.